Hello everyone, um, this is the new video series of uh, CDS View and that UI5. So in this tutorial series I will use um, SAP HANA Studio above trial version and I will use the schema of the S flight and uh, obviously UI5. So first I will create a two CDS view and after that I will binding this to CDS view and I will create a service and after that I will call this service from the UI5. So uh, let's start. So first of all actually that is the very beginner level tutorial so I am starting from scratch. So in this video let's uh, first start with that SAP HANA Studio. You can do also with the Eclipse but um, I also like that HANA Studio because that, that is also related with that um, uh, business related things. I mean that administrator, administrative related things so I use that SAP HANA Studio. So let's start. So from here, um, first I have to create a project. So this is above cloud project or above project. So I will select above project next. So here I can find that all system which is already connected in the GUI. So from here I select above trial next so that is uh, everything is coming from that SAP GUI so next I have to put the client I use you have to put next so basically that is the project name so just finish Uh, open the EVA perspective, yes, because that is all related with the EVA. So now you can see that actually it is connected, but the problem is that it is not showing. So that's the reason we have to go to the window view. And if I select like um, show view project explorer so now you can see that this project explorer is here so sometimes i found that uh, some people like create many time because they cannot see here so there's the reason first you have to make sure that um, show view and the project explorer is here so now uh, we have to create a new view so that is the reason first i'm click on that so everything I will create on that uh, local directory. So now click on there. New. Um, you can select that other above. So now actually that is the data definitions. So you can see that is the code data service. What we call that CDS. From here we have to select the data definition so click next so um, here actually we have to give a name so for example that is like um, jet a s flight Um, so UI5 tutorial I can see jet file so UI5 tutorial um, that is fine just next no need transport request so click next so from here you can see that um, different uh, template so from here you can see the defined view entity 
or define root view entity uh, everything is same but uh, actually uh, same means that only template is different but actually we are going to create a new view so I am just selecting this finish so let it start so it's already uh, there but what I will do I will just remove everything uh, and I will I will start from scratch so here actually that above catalog SQL view name so that is the jet a I can say the SQL view so I will create on view from here so that is for the one table and another uh, thing is that um, then udata udata Published to because we have to create udata and this udata we have to call from the uh, UI5 application. So now you can see this is um, this view is um, the header type of view is annotation is done. So now we have to define view then now that is the name of the view jet is so basically that is the sql view what you can see in the sql even but this view you cannot see in the sql even so i can actually that is the cds view what you can use everywhere so define view then as as select from table so our table name is this okay so now here this start so we have to we will not use that all field we will just use like first this mandate is not required because that is the client so we will use only the three field just copy from here so that is the key Uh, actually this name is long so I can just select SQL is not view so this error is already created so select jet a SQL I can see that um, jet a SQL jet flight is not good. 
okay I can put just one so now I have already just um, saved and active it's look good so from here if I select this view as I told that SA level here actually you can see this view so data okay so this is good so from here we can also check like run as applications you can see the output of the data so um, in the next um, video I will create uh, another view that is for that uh, flight information uh, from this table so okay